For all the banter and piss taking at 4 6 pence, it turns out they were right all along, as the PGMOL have just come out and said that there's no audio available for Ashley Young's foul on Callum Hudson Adoy, which was the third and most obvious penalty of the lot. Despite it flashing up on the screen that VAR had checked and cleared Anthony Taylor's on field decision, it's been found that Stuart Atwell decided not to review the situation at all, even though Sky Sports and the PGMOL clearly stated that it was checked. Lads, what the flying fuck is going on here? I mean, seriously, you've just had two organizations which are essentially running the Premier League caught out lying, yet the media and pundits dare not bring it up because they're also in bed with these other frauds. Alarm bells should have been ringing the second the PGMOL told Forrest that they're happy to share the audio of the discussion between Anthony Taylor and Stuart Atwell, but only in private. When Liverpool had that disaster of a decision go against them versus Tottenham, they rightly went apeshit in the aftermath, and the authorities that be ensured the conversations that took place behind the scenes were made public in the name of sporting integrity. So why should this be any bloody different? They set the president then themselves and are now backing away from it. Given the circumstances, can you really blame Forrest for going nuclear? They've exhausted every platform for complaint in a season full of grievances against the PGMOL, and now it's been found that there's something mighty dodgy going on behind the scenes. Only time will tell what excuse Howard Webb comes out with on that joke of a segment mic'd up, where he and Michael Owen review the most dogshit decisions made by Webb's former colleagues in an attempt to gaslight supporters. All I can say is fair play to Forrest. They've been mocked and ridiculed all week, but their decision to take action it's opened up a can of worms which exposes deep-rooted incompetence and likely corruption, which has been festering inside the PGMOL. Let me know your thoughts on this farcical situation down below, and I'll catch you in the next one, folks. Peace.